Not a fan of the latest Garmin Connect app update? If you prefer the older interface, you can downgrade your Android app. Just remember, this is a temporary solution as Garmin may eventually make older versions incompatible. Also, note that you might lose some settings when reverting, so be prepared to adjust your app preferences afterward. Last month, Garmin rolled out a significant update to its Connect app, revamping the user interface with a new look and feel. The update sparked mixed reactions. Some users felt the updated app boasts a cleaner, more modern design with a focus on visual appeal. Information is presented using cards, which they find easier to digest, but other users disagree. They find themselves having to scroll more to find the same data they easily accessed before. Additionally, the new user interface has been criticized for being less customizable than the previous version. If you are one of the unhappy ones and you own an Android phone, there's a way to revert back. It's worth noting, this is only a temporary solution. Sooner or later, you will need to update to the new app. With the health warning out of the way, let's get down to the nitty gritty. First, you need to uninstall Garmin Connect from your phone. Don't worry, your fitness data will still remain in the cloud. Then you need to download an older version of the app. Go to a trusted site like APK Mirror. I'll post a link below. On some phones, you may need to install APK Installer from the App Store. However, most modern Android phones allow direct installation of APK files, so for them this would be an unnecessary step. Next, you need to install the old version of Garmin Connect, the one that you downloaded. Right after that, disable auto-updates by going into the Google Play Store, searching for Garmin Connect and unchecking the Enable Auto-Update option. The last step is, log into the newly installed app with your Garmin Connect username and password. As mentioned, you may need to configure the settings as some of them may not have carried over from the previous version. Now you can enjoy the good old interface. Let's hope Garmin takes note of the feedback and continues to improve the overall user experience of their app while considering how to better integrate feedback from their dedicated user base.